Okay, so I'm on a planet I've explored before. I've had a shave and I have a new bot. I've, I've added stream elements to my channel instead of Nightbot because Nightbot's got a habit of just being mean to people. So this is going to be just as much messing about with stream elements as it is playing No Man's Sky. So for anybody watching, please talk, post emotes, anything you like, and see how stream elements behave, and there's actual people here as opposed to me just, me just talking to myself in the chat. Nice to see Wisebot's doing its job straight away again. Yeah, thanks for that. It is, frankly, a busy Wisebot. It just doesn't, doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything right anyway. So, um, So yeah, I have on um, I've set up ah, hello Wisebot, thank you very much. Speak of the devil. The rather 30 followed today, thank you very much. Puts me on 175 followers. Seven people followed since uh, followed over the course of the week since I was last online, which was last Monday night. Which is cool. So now getting closer to 200. I have no idea, no idea what these guys do. I'll stop his music playing, shut him up. I'll throw stuff at me, I don't care. Great. Oh, you know how to make that. Right. Um. So, yeah, is there anybody in the boat? Feel free to chat. There we go, three elements. Oops. There we go, so that's working. Okay, so yeah, that looks right so far doing what I expected it to do. Those little things. Never have too much poop on them. Always handle it. Well, I'm looking for a star bolt. And these ships, I believe, are searching for my ships on the landing pad. Isn't that, it's that nice, nice thing. Yeah. 
So the dreaded night bot is gone. Replaced. Replaced with stream elements. The stream elements does more things. Yeah. <laughs> I'm currently I'm currently rank seven on my own leaderboard. That's hilarious. Um, but yeah, so I've got the I've got the command, the chat commands up on, so I can test them out with some play. Which is cool. I think I might actually. Um, people might actually score points for hosting this. <laughs> Which is hilarious. Let's see. Um, blah, 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 blah. So yes, let's have a look. So we've got a shout out command. Let's see if it's working properly. Let's pick someone who's currently playing. Go and spell it right now. It's so bad at this time. There you go. Let's try someone else. Awesome. There's a couple of people worth what worth going to check out. Uh, what else we got on one? So this seems to be holding up. A night bot no more. Good. So that seems to be working. Okay. So that's working. Right. Let's go and find some emerald. Let's. I don't know default commands, so terrible button. Um, let's find one of our buttons. I've got our. Oh, oops, cool. Let's not die. It's not really doing my health in a stupid storm. This little thing. There we go. It's me and Spring Elements talking to ourselves. Fine. Testing stuff out. Okay, well we don't have... Hey dude, how's it going? We don't have any song requests stuff on here. Um, not bad dude, I'm just popping around. And um, 
I've just checked, took Nightbot off my account, put Steam Elements on, so Stream Elements. So I'm testing out some of the features of that, shout outs and so on and so forth. Boom, there we go. Working, working, working like it should be. Yeah, there's my... That doesn't seem to go above five slots, four slots by the way. I tried to add a fifth one, it didn't work. Technology though, up to 12. So that's 12 plus 16, I've got 52 slots across everything. We've got all this stuff, space here, but they've actually got no tech, no tech blueprints to put in there, so. But yeah, it's not, not too bad, I'm just literally, tonight's stream is all about just messing around with the, the boss, doing a bit of mining, and uh, raising a bit of money. Up to 11 million at the moment, so I reckon to get a decent sized hauler with a considerable, considerable amount of new extra slots, I need um, I need about 25 million. Um, so. Ah, can you add more when you've got... Oh crap, oh, hold on a minute, I've got no iron. Okay, let's go, and, let's go and smash up some of these things for some iron. Okay, wrong one. Where's one out of iron? So if you get your, if you fully upgrade your, your, your standard slots, you can get you can add, add more cargo slots. Does that that makes sense, kinda? I might do that. But yeah, keep chatting away. Post post some emotes and stuff. I want to see if, I want I want to see if Nightbot behaves itself. Uh, sorry, Stream Elements behaves itself with the modern moderation and stuff. Please, please go to town. It's free, just... Oh, I spill myself a bloody. What's well, Pokey? Hello, and thank you for pressing follow. How you doing? Nice to see you, sir. How are you? <laughs> there we go, lots of emotes and stuff. Looks ridiculous on the PlayStation chat, it doesn't work at all. It just comes up with the name of the emote. Uh, yeah, I want to drop pod. But yeah, it's... Um, I had a shave especially for this stream. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I think, let me just check guys, hold on, uh, I've set it up so that you get uh, 10 points for viewing, 200 if you follow, 200 if you tip, 500 if you sub, 100 if you cheer, hosting gets you a bonus, bonus points, uh, but you basically get a mark every minute, I might up that, it doesn't seem like very many, that seems like pretty pathetic really, so let's change that, let's make that 100 points for every, every minute, why not? I currently have nothing you can buy with it, so I'm just getting it all. I'm just getting it all up to speed. Uh, so yeah, 
I'm just looking at the... I don't need to change the volume of the music, it's got no song request because the PlayStation stream. I don't need to pause the song. Just give your loyal followers all of the marks. You know what? I'll, I'll... That currently have zero value, yeah, so uh, let's just try some stuff out. Well, that didn't work. I think it's add points. Is it add points? Is it an S? Oh, I missed an S out. Yeah, I missed an S out. Let's try. I don't know, dude. Does not, it's not worth anything at the moment, so... They're not actually worth anything at the minute. Maybe that's just a bonus for... Uh, the people that are watching now on the first first time. Uh, bear with me a second. A hundred marks for every ten minutes it is, so it's ten it's ten marks a minute. So it's not a hundred it's not a hundred for every minute. Three hundred marks and subscribers get it tripled. Uh, yeah. If only my, my only subscriber wasn't my mate Dave. <laughs> um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's have another look. Let's try that again. Okay. Yay. Ah, you see, let's uh, let's Pokey got bonus points for uh, following. So, so yeah, that's good. Now, I'm sure I saw in the stream elements setup there's a way of setting it so that you can um, do like um, like. Quizzes and competitions and stuff. That's something I'm gonna, I'm gonna shammy with the points. That's something I'm gonna look into. I just didn't want Nightbot anymore. Because every time a Nightbot just seems to just. It's got a habit of. It seems to have a habit of banning. It's banned a couple of people, I think, on my channel, and I just didn't want faff around with it anymore. So now I've basically imported everything to Nightbot, tweak some of the tweak some of the commands. Everything from Nightbot rather. Tweak the commands and now I don't have to have Nightbot on here at all. Which is nice. Oh there goes the lid in my drink. Shit. Oh, I'm just going to get myself another suit to upgrade. Oh, I couldn't even make that jump. Oh dear, that was bad. Yep, we'll have that one. See, so if I had a damn Atlas pass, I'd be able to get some of these from the starships. Alright, let's see if I can find another one. I'm a brave man. Hello, dude. How are you? Did you bring me a point? Why am I a brave man? Playing this game or... Oh, no, dude. This game has been... is so much better than it was. Plus, I had it, I had it at launch. Um, collected edition. Got very, very disappointed with it after about a week. Um, tra traded it in. And then picked it up on picked it up on digital for a tenner, and now with the patches they put in the la just the, th the three patches they put out in the last week, the Atlas Atlas Pass, 
and so the Atlas update and the, and the subsequent tweaks to correct the bugs have really, really improved the game. It would improve massively if it would give me a fucking Atlas pass, though. Uh, I don't think the command is top points. I'm going to put some of the commands on the on the on my page at some point. I think the command you want for the leaderboard is. Uh, uh, you want to use uh, leaderboard. I think it is. Yeah, I yeah, I think the command is. Oh, dude, progress is an understatement. It's, it's completely changed. It completely changed the game. Um, Starcom in the chat, he's been he's played it to death since it launched, and. There is an in can't one as well. In chat one, you mean? Yeah, I thought that's what you meant. <laughs> Hello, low mouth. How, how you doing? Where did you leave No Man's Sky? Um, I based, Marv, after the big patch, I started again. I just deleted my save. I just thought there's no point going back to it. I deleted my save, started again from scratch. There's that much different. There's, there's that much different in it. Um, it made it didn't seem to make any sense. Um, Starcom in the chat on the other hand, he he um, he continued, I believe, his original save. So, oh, you're on the iPad. <laughs> no one of your chat. No one of the chats are hit, a bit hitting this. What's that sentiment doing? It is. So division is on anomaly suppression duty, whatever that means. Um, but yeah, the um, I shall, I'll just demonstrate quickly my favourite update to the game since the patch is the ability to actually do proper low-level flying as opposed to the bouncy. No, dude, no worries. Thanks for staying. Thanks for popping along, dude. Always a pleasure to have you say hello and help help test my new bot. Just chatting away helps the bigger yeah? bot throws in another comment out there. Brilliant, it's doing its job. But yeah, look, look, Marv, the proper low level flying look. You can actually you can actually crash. There's some kind of back look. You can actually hit things look and damage your ship. And although it technically makes the game more difficult, it makes the game feel a lot, a lot better. Um, I really enjoy just flying around the planets and then occasionally spotting something and spotting something and I'm going like, look, that's not. I've always landed right off a knowledge stone. Perfect. So learn some more language, guys. What's what, Commencing, because that's a really important word to know. Anything else around here? Ah, there we go. That's what I want. Star bulbs. Oh, black. What's this? Aluminium. Yeah. Farm some of that. But yeah, uh, Starcom, you were right. It's, um, once I can got through the base the minimum of the base quests uh, advanced mining laser uh, hazmat gauntlets um, there's my there's my current build of my multi-tool um, is there any benefit to keeping the similar upgrades next to each other because I notice they get highlighted together when they're next to each other does that provide any kind of boost or linked ability or is it just to, for the for the look of it Starcom, you might know. Anybody else in the chat, if you know, let me know. Because I'm not sure. I've tried to group them as much as I can, but...
I don't know if it actually does anything apart from um, visually like in Destiny when you uh, fully level up uh, a weapon yeah Marv I, th I believe they stack but if you notice here look on these four in the, these four here so hold on so if the, you get a boost if they're next to each other oh yeah look plus plus Okay, okay, so if I have them next to my bolt caster. Right, I see. So realistically what I need to do is dismantle this shit and rebuild my rebuild my multi tool from scratch. That's not too bad actually, I could do that quite easily. Cause I'd want to put all these beam intensifier crappy craps over over here put the scanner stuff at one end weapon stuff in the middle right i did i did wonder because they're all linked together look but they're not but applying a boost to anything i also wondered when i saw oh, that that explains stark on when i saw your ship where all the all the hyperdrive stuff was next to each other that makes that makes sense now right looks like i've got to rebuild the multi-tool okay 24 slots it's easily done Right, should we do a bit of farming? Not with, a, not with that you won't, idiot. How much is aluminium per unit? Let's have a look. 165. Hmm. I got 500 there. You know what? Should we go and find some emerald? I'm sure this planet has emerald on. Uh, no, nickel aluminium. Mm -hmm. Okay, you know what? Let's go someplace else. I have actually. I have actually effectively done this planet. I've got. I've got all the. Uh, all the animals, all the fauna and flora. Let's just do a little bit of... Let's get ourselves some fuel. I do like doing this. The kind of bit of asteroid farming, just for some iron and thamium. Usually until one of the locals gets upset. Oh. Wonder if you've seen that before, Mal. When the when the freight has come in, it does look it always looks impressive. Even better when your name's Starcom and you can call your own freighter. That looks rude. That does look rude. Cool. Right, let's. Okay then. Marvel. The freighters are ridiculous price. But you know how you, um Who was it who said something about bank uh where's that freighter gone? Am I going They're behind me aren't they? Ooh, there they are. Have you seen the inside of a freighter yet, Marv? Oh there's there it is. Pretty cool. I mean, just look at the size of the thing. Have you found the you found the captain? No, how to talk. The captains are hilarious. So I saved one freighter in a dogfight, and he was like, "Yeah, yeah, cool, yeah." Um, here's a discount. My freighter's now only eighty nine million. I was like, <laughs> "Yeah, like I'm going to afford that." Okay, right. Let's make another. Let's make a jump and go look at another system. Let's do another another complete system. Yeah, whatever. I'm not going there. Atlas, 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 Dark Galactic Core. Come on, map. Right, thank you. That was a baby freighter. 89 million.
Can't quite drink there yet. Oh, I can. Oh, I forgot I upgraded my I upgraded my hyperdrive. I can jump 300 light years now. And I've been doing really short hops and wasting warp cells. <laughs> oh dear. Let's go to an Atlas station and get to learn some new words. Doki. Let's see what I've got to say at this station. Oh, no, no kidding, there's an Atlas interface discovered. It's like gigantic. Yeah, I'm doing the Atlas path, path first. I've, I, um, it's, I, I'm doing it because when I first played the game, I, I, the first question I asked you about the Atlas path, I said no, and then never picked up the Atlas path again, and I was really annoyed because I wanted to actually do it. So this playthrough, I'm doing the Atlas path. Um, and then I suppose, however, you, whatever happens when you get to the end of that, then I'll then go and do. I'll then head to the Galactic Core, I suppose. But as of right this minute, I am at this passing. At the next. Um, the next anomaly with Polo and what's his name, Nada, or whatever his name is. I'm going to do another black hole, I think, because that was fun. Although it did wreck my, uh, you're right, it wrecked one of my bits of equipment. It wrecked my Cyclotron Ballista, which was a shame. But then I fixed it literally within seconds. <laughs> Hey, a callback to word for Destiny. It's a good job too. Destiny 2 coming out in a couple of weeks. Need to learn that word. Make sure I get my pre-order in. Oh, I've missed one over there. Crap. <coughs> Let's learn some words of callbacks. When there's bloody guys on the space station, it starts to make more sense once I learn a few more words. I need to do more monoliths as well to get to learn some more Atlas words, because the Atlas things just make no sense. It's just... How is everybody anyway? What have you all been playing today? You've been, play you been playing games? I can probably guess what Starcom's been playing. Marv, I'm sure I saw you won Uncharted earlier. Have you finished four? Have you finished it all yet? Ah, still on Uncharted 4. Cool. I've got Lost Legacy arriving tomorrow. Ah, you finally did it, Starcom. Awesome. You got your face on somewhere sensible as opposed to where it left you after the uh, update. I got my, yeah, Marv, so, so if, in case you haven't noticed, I've moved all of my commands and everything across for, from Nightbot to Stream Elements. Oh! <laughs> I need my marks. You need your marks. Well, are you hosting me? You get bonus marks for that. Oh, have you followed me? Oh, you've done that already. Sorry. Uh, you could sub. Nah, you don't have to, dude. You're earning, you're earning uh, 10 marks a minute or something. Oh, I've got to tweak it. Once I've got, once they actually have a value, I will. Um, I will actually work something out. I'll just. I had them. I did have them both, Marv. But Nightbot, as you know, Keith, I was having trouble with the um, the moderation on it. Even though I, it, 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 it banned you the once for no reason for posting a couple of emotes, it. Um, I changed it all, I saved it all, 
and then and then it did the same to somebody else. So I got a bit fed up with it in the end. And um, um, Wisebot calling out the times and stream elements doing everything else. <laughs> Marv, I don't think I've got, I don't think, Marv, feel free guys, test it out, swear away, I, I don't think I've got any um, bad word filters set up yet, so test the chat out, that's what I, I want you guys here for, it'd be awesome. Uh... <laughs> uh, that's a good one Marv to start, yeah. There you go. Everybody's. I've added everybody a, a, a thousand pointless marks just for being here. How's about that? It's what you always wanted. Don't say I never give you anything that's worthless because I do. Par used height yold mip habadi. Have a do, have a do, yagant, aha, nobby, nobby, nob nobs. I have no idea what he's doing on the back. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll yield, whatever it means. Flim. <laughs> I can now make a Nova reclaimant. I have no idea what that is either. But cool. Dude, if you, if, if you like flying around in space, shooting things, scanning things, collecting things, and hanging around for bigger spaceships to turn up so you can buy them, or just generally chilling out as the captain of your own spaceship, then by all means, yeah, and it's only a tenner. De definitely, for a tenner and, and, the, and the time it takes to install all the patches, it's it's an absolute steal of a game. The amount of content in it is phenomenal. It's the unknown moon of Awalia Amwudum. Ooh, what the hell's an albumen pearl? Ooh, it's got emerald too. That's what the planet's got. More freighters just come in. Oh, I need to get my own freighter stuff. Emerald. Let's go and clear some inventory at the space station first. We may take a look at that low atmosphere. Whoa! Oh, they, oh, they, go, they go in. Oh, they. Let's look at that. That's how you dock. Dude, I think it's nine ninety nine on the PSN store, and you know you've got you've got uh, a gajillion pre um, a gajillion worlds like procedurally generated. Um, it's just it's just stupidly good. They've improved the shooting on it. They've improved the. The combat on it's improved, like the dogfighting is definitely better, the flying is better. I mean, I can actually shoot down other ships now. Beforehand, I was just like, just waving around in space, getting killed. Um, no, you're rubbish, aren't you? And that's ugly as fuck. Look at this. I mean, who the fuck designed that ship? It's probably, it probably pisses all over mine, but. And this one looks like a weird hybrid of a toilet roll. Uh, just, just, I don't even. It's got like weird things on the side, like you see in the Matrix on the, uh, the, the like, the things they fly around the, the, the sewers in. That's just, that's bizarre. Anyone else landed? No, we're good, right? Oh crap! Screwed that jump up. Oops.
But yeah, I've got. Uh, I'm looking forward to playing them. If it hopefully it arrives in the post tomorrow, then I'll uh, I'll give them Charlie to play through tomorrow. No, me neither. Um, so I know the word Corvax. I know the word push. Brilliant. I need to learn some more Corvax. I think. Health module. Radiation deflector. Mm. No, I've got those already. I don't need any more of them. What you've got it or have you got it already? Did you come early in the post or have you pre ordered it digitally and you're waiting for it to install? Just wondering, because mine's from Amazon, so no it's nice from shop too. Oh, I've had this guy before, he gets whatever you do he, he moans, so it's asking for help. Yeah, have you got it? Is it digital? Ah, oh, directions, come on, send me to a crash ship. Manufacturing facility, potential Atlas Pass. Yes, we'll have a bit of that. Ah, so you've paid twenty nine ninety nine for the pre -order, the digital pre order, or equivalent local currency. Yes, I'll also, I'll snort the robot. Yeah, that's, that's that sounds like fun. Oh, here he is. Look there. Gra gra da. Marv, you see that? He almost said the uh, universal greeting from Transformers. Bar weep, gra na weep, ninny bong. I'll chant along. Beta Jax. Do you mean Jack and Daxter? Bar weep, gra na weep, ninny bong. Yeah, you know it. Yes, the, uh, I had an email from Shop2 earlier. Basically, they sent me the code already, uh, but it can't be redeemed until the game is actually on the PSN store, which I believe is this Wednesday. So, yeah, Jack, I'm looking forward to playing Jack and Daxter, possibly even more than I am looking forward to playing um, Uncharted. Because it was one of my favourite PS2 games when it first came out. Um, so, looking, looking forward to playing that. Yeah, Wednesday. Although I might sneakily try my code on the American PSM store. See if I can get a hold of it tomorrow. Ah, oh, boo! USA! USA! Right, let's go check out this manufacturing facility. Guys, if you, if, um, if you think that the stream elements pop-ups are, are, are too regular, let me know. I can, I can tweak the timings on them. It, they're, coming up, they're coming up after so many chat lines, or, or if not chat, they come up after every so many minutes. So if you think if you think they're too regular for you and they're intrusive, just give me a shout and I can tweak the timings. I need to add a few more different ones as well because it's it's got the Team MZ one, it's got my Twitter account one, um, and I did I, uh, there was another one, but I don't think it seems to be working. I have to check that. Let's see if I can get myself an Atlas Pass. No, don't land in the water. Oh no, it's landed at the beacon. We're good. Cool. Thank you, Marv. Oh, passive sentinels. Fantastic. Ah, see, I've been watching Band of Brothers, so... In Band of Brothers, everybody with an American accent is called a Yank. So. <laughs> Already done, I've done that. Right then. So we bolt caster out, get ready to, sh get ready to shoot down these sentinels. Just smash my way into this place. What have we got? Platinum, blah 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 blah. I want to know what our albumin pearl is. And tell you what, getting the, up, getting the bloody upgrade for the Piper Drive was a nightmare trying to find all those fungal pearl things. 
Ah, there's the door. Right. Right then, let's kill some sentinels. Marvin, I cannot recommend enough getting the uh, homing bolt upgrade for your bolt caster. Because you can just vaguely aim in their direction. It's a little like tracking grenades in Destinal. In De Destinal! Destiny. Uh, you, know the, you know the grenades, I mean, the fusion grenades. I don't even have to really aim and I can kill those guys no end. So, here we go. Watch, this is where I screw things up. I don't know enough Corvax. Muffly, buffly, buffly, wuffly power. Buffly droid disruption. There's a power disruption. Hmm. Small creatures through the... Yes! You've chosen wisely. Come on, give me an Atlas Pass, please. No! No! <sighs> Quest for a random Atlas Pass continues. While I'm here, let's go and find myself another couple of... Um, With a couple of upgrades. Yeah. Oh, Marv, we know all about that, don't we? Not another bloody identical gun to the one I got on the last raid. Oh, Marv, I, I am only now uh, two. Marv, you're like touched. You and you and Craig together. Craig on his Titan. Get, decides he wants a weapon, he drops for him. Um... But yeah, the um, I dropped in to help some of the Dads of Destiny guys with. Um, oh crap! That's 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 how you fly badly. Um, oh, sh I'm misjudging this spectacularly. Uh, that's just spotted some emerald. That's nice. Uh, dropped in Dads of Destiny last week to help them with uh, Covix, Wrath the Machine. Did ran Covix twice. Challenge mode twice. Picked up two of the. Uh... Am, I, am I seeing things? Where's this drop off? Oh, I just missed that completely. Picked up the uh, Steel Medulla and the Genesis Chain Adepts. Two of the three that I was missing, which was really, really sweet. I think I'm doing Volta Glass on Wednesday night for the uh, for hopefully find to finally get a legendary fight bringer, which would be lovely. But I doubt I'll get it. And after that, after this week, I'm probably because I've got my um, I'm away the weekend, then I've got my oh for the uh, Wrath Armor. I never bother with the Wrath Armor. Call. No worries, Ghost. Thanks for dropping by. Look after them marks, they might be worth something one day. Um. Oh crap, what am I doing? I ran it with Carolina Gamer. For the lols today, as he needed space. He needed space? What do you mean, needed space? I'm confused. Oh, he's. I'm sure that makes sense. I'm just not seeing it. Oh, he had a space. <laughs> Marv, you're tired writing it, I'm tired reading it, so yes, it's. Uh... 
I get what you. I understand what you mean. Now. He had a space, and you, and you helped him out. Right, got. I got yeah. I'm just glad I've got. I'm just glad I've got it pre-ordered digitally. So literally, as soon as midnight rolls around, it should be available. I'm in two minds whether to stream it from the start in the story mode or whether to just play it at my own pace. I don't know. It's, I just know that the Destiny 2 streaming is going to be... I still haven't done it on hard mode, Marvin. I'm, I've no interest in doing it now. I've beat him once. I don't care that it was only normal. I'm happy that it's done. And... That's it. What is that up there? Oh god, that's the space station! <laughs> wow, I didn't even... I'm just glad that I got it beat once. So... No, that was pretty cool. My nanites from that. A little bit more plutonium. But, you know, I'll mine with the laser, that would be much easier. I'm going to get my uh, sacks about this. Yeah, Vault of Glass I'm expecting, with the team we've got put together for Vault of Glass on Wednesday, I'm expecting us to get through that in about 40 minutes tops. The only thing that will slow us down is if um, is the challenge mode for the, what's going to call it? Whose name escapes me? Why, why, why can't I think of the guy's name? Marth, what's his name? The, the the Templar, that's him. Templar challenge mode. Right, let's go have a look at the other planet in the system. Atheon challenge mode, we yeah. Atheon challenge mode. I don't think I've killed him normally since the raid came out. It's always been challenge mode. Oh, it's the moon, isn't it? Oh, hello. Is that the planet I've just been on? Yeah. That planet's awfully close. Hold on, am I getting this backwards? Was I on the moon? Two bodies, one moon. Yeah, we've usually got one, at least one person who can do the relic run. I mean, we had somebody do it the other week because we were so we were able to smash um, to deal with do the DPS. The guy running the relic didn't really have much. It was his first ever attempt at doing it, and he and he did it first time. So I used to run relic in year one. And I don't mind doing it in, if we're not doing challenge. I just can't get the timing right on the uh, oh, excuse me. What sort of planet we got here? I didn't even check on the scan. Did anyone notice what we had? I, didn't, I don't even think I scanned it properly. Well, we got caves. Got me crashing into the floor. I'm just going to set it down over here, I think. There's a reasonably even bit of land. Let's see what we see. What we got? Low sentinels. No floor. No fauna. No flora. Occasional. Occasional rocks. <laughs> wow, I can scan a couple of rocks. Okay, guys, I think I've officially found the shittest planet in the game. Let's see if there's even anything here. This planet has nothing. Let's at least try and grab a drop pod from it. 
Oh, at least there's some. <laughs> the drop pods on the other planet. This planet has nothing. I don't think I've ever seen that before. When it actually gives you a, a waypoint on another planet. <laughs> That's phenomenal. Yep, you read that correctly. There is nothing on this planet. There's so little stuff on this planet. The drop pod is on another world. That must be the space station up there. Let's just see if I can get that. Another quick scan. But there's a sentinel. Must have a really important job on here. Oversight patrol. <laughs> so just put the sentinel out of its misery. Can't get. I can't. I can't look up high enough to see the sp to see the space station. Christ. See if there's a monolith on that. I didn't know you, could, I, you know what? I didn't actually know you could use the same one again. Oh, please. Okay, I think I'm actually confirming that this planet has nothing. I'm going to take that plutonium and leave. This is just shit. I think it's time to warp to another system. Ooh, I don't know. What have you just found here? <gasps> oh, Ooh, yeah. Make ourselves some money. Yep, if uh, if you are still watching, you might as well go make yourself a coffee now and maybe here a while. I think it's fairly safe to mine on this planet because the sentinels don't give a shit. Thank you for the host, Marvin. That's much appreciated. Sorry, I didn't see that comment before. It's, uh, apparently, it's used on Warlock to run at your land cleaner. Ah, got ya. Is that the uh, Templar Relic? Got ya. Well, I always say Warlock jumping is not as bad as people say. Uh, I'm very competent at the old uh, Oryx. Oryx jumping. But the last two times I've cleared that raid, I've been the, uh, I've been the Relic holder, the Brand holder or whatever it's called running the platforms. I got mocked the first time I offered to do it. Oh, you're a warlock? Can't you switch to a hunter? No, because hunter jumps as shit. In my opinion. Hunter jumps make me feel like I'm playing Rainbow Islands. Those who aren't aware, me and Marvin uh, play, play a crap ton of Destiny. Occasionally together. I mean, I'm sure I've asked you this before, Marvin. You are playing Destiny 2 on both consoles, aren't you? And PC when it comes out. Or are you just going to stick to PS4 and PC? It's almost time to go down into the pits and see how much we've actually got down. Uh, well, I'm not going to disagree with that comment, Marv. Um... Oh shit, yeah dude, I forgot. Is that definitely the date? It, it all happens. That does suck, dude.
so two days before the launch have you got plans for the launch Marv are you do are you, are you streaming in any particular order or are you just going to play it through yourself and then stream later on the multiplayer I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm in two minds what to do Destiny, dude, are you, are you, are you going to... Oh, right, yeah, I'll go. <laughs> Got you. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I mean, I'm going to be off because my, my knee manipulation is the 31st, so literally a week after that is when Destiny launches. I'm going to be off for at least a couple more weeks after the, the procedure. <laughs> um, I think I, I, I am at the moment because of, because of what's been going on. So... Yeah, I've got that many appointments in the next... I mean, I've had hospital today. I've got another appointment Friday. We're away the weekend. I've got physio next week. Then hospital next Thursday till Friday. Hopefully come out of that in a, a with the ability to actually walk properly, which would be lovely. If not, we as a... As a... Um, Alex McLeish, or whatever the Villa Boss used to say, we, we go again. Try and work out what the hell we're doing. Oh, I can move that platinum into the, into the other truck. Yeah, I, I, don't think it's a, I don't think it's a muscular problem. I mean, I can walk, I can stand. I just can't bend the bloody knee. It's really, really frustrating. Okay, right. You're not on the camera, Faye. Good. You were then. No one was. No. Um, I think once once I can bend the knee again, it shouldn't take long to come back because I'm pretty much going to be um, once that knee once the knee bend is back. <laughs> Um, I plan on heading back to work as soon as I can because money's because my SSP is going to run out and then money's going to dry up. It's going to be a real fucking ball like that. If that happens, then I'll, then you know we're, we're then looking at the likes of um, then I've got to look at the likes of possibly selling shit to survive. One of my appointments this week is with those assholes who do the uh, the. Um, what do you want to call it? You know, the personal, personal, oh, you know what I mean. Trying to claim off the government because they're incapacitated. That's what my appointment is Friday for an assessment where somebody with a checklist is going to tick off the fact that I can make a cup of tea and wipe my own ass and tell me that I'm, uh, that they can't help me. That's, oh no, the personal injury thing is, is, um, that's ongoing, dude. That's, DWP, mate. That's what I mean. But it's a company called Capita who do the assessments for a for a, for a PIP personal. In, I don't know why it's fucking stands for, but I wasn't wasn't planning on having to claim it, but money has become an issue. So I skint in it. Hence my copy of Uncharted was ordered with credit that I had. Every game I've got here was ordered was paid for with credit or bought from work where I can refund it. I had a look at The Witcher 3 earlier today and I gotta be honest, I think it's going I think it's going back to work. I've just felt I don't know, just there's something I just didn't didn't it hasn't clicked with me. I have just I'm about an hour and a bit into it and I'm just like oh, I don't think I can put the hours into it. Yeah, there's not a lot. You, it's, it's difficult though, Mark, because it's not. For make it so fucking difficult to do it, and they and they have all these stupid criteria, you know. And it's just and the whole jumping through hoops thing. I've done it with them before, and they've lied through their teeth in the past when I was between jobs. Um, the housing, the Boom and City Council lied to their teeth saying they need, they hadn't got information, I had proof that they had, and, and then they paid me, and then they said that I owed them money, and it just got really horrible. 
and I wasn't I was hoping not to have to get involved with it again but we'll see I've got to see and my boss wants to come and visit me again next week he's not put any pressure on me to go back which is nice but I think it's more he wants to see how I am socially kind of thing so I did tell him to watch my Twitch, watch my Twitch streams. He'll see. <laughs> Cheers, dude. Well, luckily, some very good friends of ours are putting us up. Are putting us up at the weekend in their hotel. So, we've got a. Oh no, dude! Yes, yeah, way past your bedtime, mate. It's five past midnight. So thanks for stopping by and saying hi, dude. It's a pleasure. Thanks for hosting. I think I had another host earlier in the chat. I, must, I missed it while I was chatting. Uh, Crimson BZD is also hosting me for up to three viewers. Uh, thank you, Crimson BZD. Whomever you may be. Yes, yeah, so thank, thank you for stopping by and shouting at, um, and saying fuck nuggets and flim flam fom in my chat to make to see if uh, stream elements was behaving itself it seems to be holding up so far and I've got it but I must work out something to, to do with those uh, loyalty points I don't think there's any point in me setting up my own personal discord but we'll but we'll uh, I don't think I'm going to ever be that big a streamer to need my own personal voice channel to my uh, followers. We'll see. Yes, for those of you who are still watching, this is me mining Emeril to make money. Um, what you'll notice is that I... Is that I, when I find a nice big fat emeril deposit such as this, I absolutely pick the fucker clean. I am swimming. Where's my torch? I am swimming in plutonium, so fueling the laser is not a problem. Generally speaking, I find a deposit, I literally pick it clean. What I tend to do is, is, is dig down to as low as it goes on one side and then just work my way across. And we've got about another 50 minutes left of stream time before. I watched the first WWE Raw post following SummerSlam, so... So if your idea of fun is listening to a brummy guy talk crap about games, wrestling, movies and shit like that, whilst firing a red laser at some green rocks, then by all means, hang about. If this isn't your cup of tea, well, I am not forcing you to be here. It is nice when people chat. So here's my little corner. I, oh, let's see, this what these are noise with a little bit of stick in the air. Now let's work our way across the ground, clearing everything. So yeah, so um, this is me mining. What I'll do is I'll sell most of this in this system from the ship's inventory, and then I'll probably sell the rest uh, after short hyper jump to the next system. Simply because um, I only noticed it recently is that the price drops after a single transaction. So you can no longer just sell a load of stuff from your ship inventory and then 
sell the same stuff at the same price from your exosuit. Is it the price literally drops the moment you make the transaction, the first transaction? So anybody, anybody still hanging about? Uh, there's been a few people in chat this evening. We've had. The big Marvin skin. Uh, Marvin uh, is a variety streamer. Uh, however, I believe he's going to be um, focusing quite heavily on Destiny 2 when it comes out. Uh, I could be wrong. Uh, I've known him for a number of years. Uh, um, he's been streaming a little longer than I, a, a few a month or so longer than I have. Top fella, well worth a watch. Uh, currently playing through the Uncharted series, to, to, similar to what, how I did with Tomb Raider, just just because he's had it for that long, he needs to play it. Um, then also in chat today we have had Starcom. Now, uh, if you're as old as I am, you remember Starcom was a range of toys you could get, complete spaceships. And so on and so forth. Now I don't know if how old Starcom is. All I do know is that he is exceptionally rich in his in his No Man's Sky game. Uh, I mean, this is a dude who, uh, for the first time ever, I saw somebody call in a just literally just casually call a freighter into the star system and had it warp in to join him. He has his own fleet of ships. He has. Uh, Millions in the bank. He's an exceptionally good uh, guy to watch if you want to see some what I would probably call end game No Man's Sky. If you want to see some end game kind of No Man's Sky stuff with like freighters and fleets of ships and lots of money and so on and so on and so on. Um, Why is that there? Ah, uh, too much zinc. Let's have the zinc back. New William back. What else can we get the Optum Flip to free up some more room for. I think we'll have the iron back. The more emerald room on the ship we've got to see, the better, because the ship holds 500 per slot, whereas we can own it really. Yeah, the ship holds 500 the slot, whereas this can only hold two. As long as I've got two, as a slot free here, I can, I can, I can do it. So, if I actually move. That and that back. It still still leaves me. Still leaves that, which is cool. So like it's like fill, fill that up and then transfer it. We'll laugh it. The more I can get on the ship, the more I can sell in one, one go, you see. And at around 200 and... At around 275 unit per unit, give or take the local fluctuation, usually it drops to about 240 a unit, 230. Why can't I put my... Ah, finally! Now I can see what I've got left to, left to shoot. Yeah, usually I absolutely pick these caves clean. My base in the game is actually right next to a 
couple of considerably large emerald deposits. But over time, actually respawn. Occasionally when I teleport there, I can land. Now that's not actually emerald, it's green. I can actually land. So this one here, oh, let me destroy it from that side. And just farm another couple of million. Weapon charge depleted. Charge up your weapon. There we go again. Apologies folks if you're finding this boring. Oh, I was quite clear in the name of the stream what you were going to say. In fact, you shouldn't be disappointed. I actually did some flying around. And I looked for the Sentinel. And I... That's not, that's not actually destroying. It's the same emerald, but it's not actually putting any in my inventory. It's wasting my laser. Um, I visited Atlas Station. That was cool. Now, once I've done mining here, I'm going to go on, move on to the next uh, jump. But I really do need. Thanks to Starcom's advice, I need to redistribute all the modify all the mods on my multi tool. So I'm not taking advantage of the fact that you link them together, you get boost the abilities. Lots of ports left. Wow, so all the way. Not anymore. So yeah, anybody watching who hasn't decided whether or not to think that they're going to get this game, um, it's about a tenner. If you know anybody, if it, it, anybody who says, oh, it's a terrible game, it's exempt, it's nothing to do. Those people have clearly not played it since the patches. They don't take their word for it. Actually, watch people playing it or ask people who are playing it what, you, what they think the game is like and get an actual opinion. Any, someone who played it at launch and has never picked up since their opinion at this point is not valid because the game is so different now what it used to be their opinion is valid for the base game the, 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 the launch game the vanilla version and as that game doesn't exist anymore, because you can't play this without patching it. I don't believe you can anyway. I'm trying, my, my copy is digital, so I couldn't tell you, but... Um, don't listen to anybody who says... It's a, it's, it's, you need to watch it being played, you need to play it yourself. Make your own opinions. I, for example, I had it for. I think it was. Uh, I played it for about a week solid at launch. Because for me, it was the game that was going to get me off Destiny. And. I played it for about a week solid at launch and got so 
fed up with it because there's so many bugs and so many things didn't work and it promised so much and didn't deliver and uh, and that was my opinion then my opinion now is considerably different simply because the game's considerably different it's been massively updated it's a hell of a lot more fun you who mr g mr g Mr. G. Scully, how are you, sir? How are you feeling, dude? Are you... Are you tickety-boo, sir? Are you tickety-boo? So I hope you are, because I'm looking forward to watching you tomorrow. Good, good, good. I know you're probably the only one here right now, but I've got a new boss. Trying, I'll, I'll change from Nightbot to Stream Elements. The Stream Elements handles uh, shout outs, loyalty points, um, commands, and everything, and other stuff. So. I switch bots, so playing around. So, if you want to feel like exercising your fingers. Try spamming a few emotes, try spamming, try swearing a bit, or typing in capitals. I want to see what happens. Ooh! Oh, that up, didn't I? Right. Transfer. Transfer, transfer, transfer. Look at all that lovely emerald I'm going to go and sell. Beautiful! One thousand two thousand three thousand five hundred for five thousand five hundred. I should be able to take maybe a bit more yeah I saw that dude on your, on your Twitch that's awesome I still, even know, I still haven't even done mine uh, as I um, I'm not a subscriber so I'm not going to get it oh no and I've already used my Amazon Prime sub on somebody else this month I'm really sorry uh, I will I love it. That's awesome, dude. So they allowed a bat. They allowed you to use a Batman. That's quite cool. They allowed you to use a Batman. Because I thought, like, I thought licensed properties weren't allowed to. <coughs> God, that was my voice. I thought licensed properties weren't allowed to be used, but obviously, you got away with it. Cool, huh? nice one, dude. That is very cool looking. What what I'm what I'm thinking of doing uh, for mine? God, my voice has gone all. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on. What I'm thinking of doing for mine is um, is I, I I like to use <clears throat> when I'm doing my chat on Discord. I like to, and, Netflix, and you've probably noticed on Twitter when I'm welcoming all the guys into Team MZ, I I kind of use the Vulcan. Live long and prosper. Emote quite a lot. So I'm, I'm, I, what, what I'm going to try and do is try and I don't know how, how easy it's going to be given the limitations. What I'd like is, 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 is a robot of some description, kind of just doing that symbol kind of thing. Um, I've got somebody actually doing me a, a customised welcome screen. Hey, Tiny Muffy, how are you? Thanks for popping along. I'm sorry I didn't stay very long in your screen till the day. Um, but I've got a, got a, had a lot, a lot on, a lot on. I mean, I was flitting around, stream hopping. Uh, but thank you for following as well. That was awesome. I had a shave. I had a shave today, especially because I thought I knew you were coming. You played No Man's Sky uh, at all, Tiny Muffet. Is it is it a game you've looked you've played? I know you're I know you're on PS4 from watching your stream, so I was wondering whether you played this. 
Why has my torch gone out? But yeah, the emote, my sub emote hasn't haven't done it yet. It's it's coming. I'm working on it. I've got ideas. So so Gary, this entire cave was emerald when I started. This entire cave. Look at the state of that. Look at that. That's how you. That's how you pick a cave clean. I've picked it that clean. I actually have. Gary again. You know I said I sent you a couple of screenshots the other day, man. I will. Um, I will send you some more. I, I literally. I don't mind my arse. Ah, uh, Tiny Muffy, I know that I know you. Um, am I okay to use your actual name? Because saying Tiny Muffy makes me feel really silly. Um, or would you rather I didn't? It's in, it's in, entirely up to you. I'm happy either way. I can call you Muffy, I can call you Tiny, I can call you... But I'll, I'll ask you permission first before I do so. You know, etiquette and stuff. Where have I left my ship, Gary? Do you know? Did you see where I left it? Oh, well, Gary, sorry. This planet as well is so shit. Emeril aside, it's such a shit planet that when I used a, when I used a, a signal booster to search for something, the result was on that planet up there. That's how shit this planet is. Look, no... No flora, no fauna, low sentinels, no we clear weather, occasional resources. Occasional is an understatement. There's nothing here apart from that little bit of emerald. Um, ah, you're fine with that. Okay, so uh, Gary, um, Tiny Muffy in chat is uh, a former colleague of mine who used to... Back in the day, we've worked together with a certain retailer who I'm hoping we both now hate, because I don't like them anymore. I fucking can't stand them. Um, and, uh, shit, I need to craft it. Bloody. And, uh, and Tiny Muffy's name is Helen. She's a lovely girl. So, hi, Helen. Welcome to the stream. Oh, yes, I can craft a couple of power cells. That'll do it. Uh, one power gel, right? Brilliant, that's worth it. Oh, where have I left? oh there's my what's it? My ship's got to be right there. It is. So, Gary, well, the, my ship, if you can't remember, is is, is the USS Bucket, because it looks like a bucket of bolts. Um, I think it's time to get out of here and go to another planet that's actually got something worth. Let's go. And, let's go. You know what? Let's go and look at the monolith. They begin with a G. They begin with a G. They like the colour purple. And they buried the better the better retailer because of um, branding. So, what brought, what brought you into um, Helen? What, what what made you decide to suddenly to suddenly start streaming? Is it something you wanted to do, or something you've? Uh, the hell is going on here? Okay, that didn't go. That didn't work. What the hell happened? Then have I flew inside the planet or something? That's bizarre. All right, there it is. Right, stop, stop, stop. I don't know what happened then. I just went up my and everything went peat on. See the markers vanishing. Okay, there's something not right with this planet. Okay, so screw that monolith. We're not getting anywhere near that planet. Because it's 
it's bugging out and it's, it's actually letting me I'm actually flying into the planet through it is it a gas giant or something what the hell oh hold on hold on Helen say hi to Gary Gary say hi to Helen both of you like streaming horror games If you haven't already, well, you probably wouldn't have done. Um, Helen, if you haven't, if you haven't, um, Helen, the thing I love about the horror games is it's not so much it's how I first started watching Gary it's not so much the the game itself it's the reactions of the people playing now I started watching Gary because he was playing um, um, un Until Dawn wasn't it that's it Until Dawn I we, a, a mutual friend of ours on here had streamed it on lawn when it went on PlayStation Plus and it was, it was brilliant it looked really really good uh, then I streamed it and uh, I'd follow Gary in between um, and then I watched ah right okay so I don't know what that could be should be okay and then I watched Gary play it but I watched it knowing what was coming up so I could watch, I was watching it knowing full well that I was expecting Gary to jump and his reaction is hilarious. Really, really funny. So if you haven't already, well worth a follow. I think Gary's going to be, I think he said he's going to be streaming again tomorrow. Um... But yeah, he's well well worth a follow because he, he likes. To... Ah, right. Okay. So I hope it's not mine. He has played up silly buggers a few times, especially this time of night. But here we go. Let's see how much. Here you go, Gary. Let's see how much I'll make off Emerald. Um, okay, so it's all in my Starship inventory. Right. There we go. One million three eight three thousand eight hundred six units of Emerald sells for. One million for forty-three thousand four hundred thirty-two. Emerald money, money, money. The thing is, if I was to try and sell some now, some shop on the list now. If I had kept a little. SCP Contaminant Breach. Is that a PS4 game? Don't know. Don't know it. Don't know what it is. Uh, if, I'm sure and Helen P hears that comment, she'll reply. Um, but uh, yeah, Gary, the um, thing with Emerald and, and thing with tra the trade transactions, I found out because I didn't realise this was the case, I'd forgotten. If you sell from your ship inventory, you'll get the current price. If you then try and sell the overstocks from your suit inventory, the price will have plummeted. So you've got to try and make sure everything you want to sell is in one inventory, preferably the ships, it holds more. Let's see if this ship's bigger than mine. Ah, that's no, crap. I can afford it, but it's crap. Is it another horror game, Helen? Come on, Gary. Ah, cool. Come on, Gary. We all want to see you stream again, buddy. I want to see your Batman emote in action.
I've got out, I've got the first Outlast actually. I've never played it. Oh, that's why. Look, that's why it was screwing up. I was it was basically trying to shove me through that planet to get to that thing. It was like. Let's try again to get to get to the monument. I think I was going. Th it was basically trying to pulse jump me through a planet and screwing up. Oh crap! Let's get some iron. And some tamium. I'm sure I need warp right, warp court, warp, warp cell soon. No, Helen, lovely, lovely to speak to you. I hope, hope things are going well with you. Um, I'll have to catch up with. I have to catch up with you soon. Are you still at, a, around the Birmingham area, or I'll yeah? Thank you for stopping by. I'll try and catch. I'll try and catch this SCP containment bridge stream tomorrow. It sounds interesting. Ah, uh, yes, I see. It wasn't a bug as such. It was just trying to walk me through a planet. Now we have a monolith. Cool. Oh crap. So no, it's one of them. But yes, Gary, you have to get back on that get back on the stream train, man. We all want to see you. Have an emote to show off. You have a new header on your page. Your man. Hello. Oh, okay. your man Derek Akora is still in the Big Brother house, as far as I know. Oh, oh yeah, I think I remember you meant. I'm, 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 I think I knew that, Helen. I'm just terrible. Being like over 40 now, my memory is like a fucking sieve. So, apologies for that. Have fun. Take care. And um, I'll see you again soon. Oh, here we go. Sleep or resist. Sleep or resist. Hmm. Kubak's Bergen, Korvac's Echo's Bless Ludo. That makes no sense to me. Uh, let's resist. Bollocks. <laughs> Let's be honest, that was the wrong choice. Let's find another one. There's another one on this planet. There is half a fucking hour away. Shit. Let's see if I can get there. So Gary, let's let's <laughs> Gary, you little sod, you, you little bugger. Thank you for the bits. You're a legend, dude. Um, so let's say hypothetically, because we know you are, you're going, you're streaming tomorrow. You got any plans on what you're going to stream? Any ideas? You're going to play the Batman games through? You're going to stick? You're going to play some more horror or something? Or
Gary, you, you, you've now become only the third person to ever use bits on my channel, so thank you very much. It's uh, much appreciated, uh, as, as they used to say. As they used to say on... Um, was, it, was it the Asda out of Tesco adverts? Every little helps. Yeah, right, let's go and get this monolith right. The only thing, I'm, the only thing about bits, Gary, that, that really annoys me, and this is because we're in the UK, is apart from actually just going out and buying them, we have no ways of earning them. But the Americans, what they can do is they can watch adverts. And they can watch so many adverts. And, after, and, and they earn bits for watching the adverts. You know, they, they can't watch millions of them and earn millions of bits. There's like limits on how many they can do, but they effectively can get bits for nothing. I mean, how cool would that be? Just to click, just whilst watching somebody stream, click on a link, watch a couple of adverts, and then be instantly given some bits you can donate to that streamer. They need to bring something like that to the UK because I bought, um, what was it? I had an offer come through on email. I bought, I think it was twelve dollars worth of bits. Got me. It was um, on offer, and that's that's what I donated to yourself, Dex. Um, I threw the bits around to a few different streamers that I I liked. So flipping, flipping, everybody merges it waves. Where's my multi tool? It copies. It's multi-tool looks better than my own. His multi-tool is shit! Better not have lost mine. Oh, thank fuck for that. That multi-tool is a load of... Did you see... Whoa, Gary, look at this! Look at this big fucker over here. <laughs> Look at him, his fat, fat legs. I think <laughs> this guy skips leg day. <laughs> oh, that's genius. Look at his fucking arms. Look at his front legs. He, do, he just... Ha <laughs> ha! I saw you enter. I saw you pop in. Hi, Nephi. How are you, my dear? You all right? We're just marvelling at how this animal in front of me has absolutely skipped. Absolutely skipped leg day, look. Not this little one here. This big fucker here, look at this. He's, he does his arms look, look, look good in the mirror. He's all out, all out, over that shit. When it comes to leg day, he doesn't, he doesn't care. Look at them spindle legs. Why are they all... Have you noticed this, Gary? They've always got tiny heads. They, well, the animals always seem to have tiny heads. How to eat food when you can't open your mouth? Can't... Oh, have you had... Can't open your mouth. You've had some dental work done. Or well, you're wearing a, a ball gag. I don't, I don't really want to know if that's the case. <laughs> I, I, oh, it, oh, ear infection. So, oh, yeah. So, just moving it makes it. Yeah, I, I get you. If there's one thing I've learned from. from being injured because if you're ill go to the doctors or the dentist get it sorted get it sorted I was at the hospital today for my pre-op and it looks like everything's going ahead next week well provided I don't have MRSA 
which I'll find out in a couple of days. Um, but uh, yeah, it looks like my procedure next Wednesday, next Thursday is going ahead, so I'll have to go and so I have to go to the hospital next week, get checked, get book myself in, and then wait for them to help me to take me down, knock me out, stretch, twist, and manipulate my leg to hopefully set, put me in a position where I can bend the knee. And we're not talking a Game of Thrones bending the knee. To swear fealty, we're talking just like fucking climb stairs and crouch down. And, uh, so yeah, so the bit of luck next next weekend will be the first weekend in a, in a long time where I'll be able to actually climb stairs without fucking breaking my leg, my neck. Right, hold on. One second. You're getting something next week and it's Game of Thrones related. Um, your own Iron Throne. No. Uh, a dragon? A full set of pop vinyl figures. Your own Valyrian sword. Grayscale? Uh, ooh. <laughs> um, uh, a t-shirt stark t-shirt you're getting grayscale you don't want grayscale although if you live at the doctors you're not swords awesome I wish I could but uh, my kids would probably skewer me to death with them um Long claw, I like. Uh, I've got to be honest. I like the look of uh, Jamie's sword. Is it um, shit? Widow's Whale or some bollocks like that. Um, and the one that um, Brienne carries, which is shit. Uh, fuck! Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Oath Keeper. Is that right? Oath Keeper. I wish I could remember the name of the uh, Tarly sword that Sam's got. Well, I can't remember it. Have you seen... <laughs> Have you seen episode 6 yet? Please tell me you watched it earlier. Please tell me you watched it earlier. Because I thought it, I thought episode six was fucking awesome. I I watched it once. It was once it was everywhere online. I yeah, yeah, oh God, it does, doesn't it? Um, Look at that! I was standing out. I was standing out in the toxic atmosphere. Idiot. Um, I I watched it about an hour after it was very very easy to get online, and then I watched it again straight afterwards. And since then, I have watched um, since then I have watched it. Well, the last I've watched the last ten minutes from the moment she flies in to help that's it I'm not going to say anymore because there's anybody watching who hasn't seen it um, <coughs> as for the points um don't worry about them right now because they don't do shit. I'm just playing around with stream elements. Um, I'm just playing around with stream elements to um, see what's what. The points I'm going to try and do other stuff. You all got. I've given everybody who watched tonight a thousand points. 
Yes. I mean, I think this is one of the reasons why they've gone to the, the, the fit more featurey lengthy episodes because it just um, it just seems better. Apparently, the finale is eighty minutes long, so that's like a movie. So Monday nights next week is going to be almost like watching a fucking movie. Yeah. Well, the, the rumor is that the whole the next season is pretty much going to be like watching seven movies or six movies. <clears throat> to be fair, the pace this season has felt wrong. Yeah, it, it's felt like too much has been crammed into seven. It feels a little... Uh, I'll start to remember it. Yeah, whereas this season it's been ridiculously... You know, some of the... You know, the the Lannisters take High Garden and it's just... It's a little bit of fighting. Daenerys takes Castle Rock. The first time you've ever seen Castle Rock in the show and it's like a little... It's like a tiny little quick scene of... And it's, it's, it was so quick. I mean, the fight, the first reveal of Cassidy Rock should have been a hell of a lot better. In my opinion. It deserved more than just a, oh yeah, we're going to do Cassidy Rock now. Interesting to see what... Exactly. It, it felt like a bit of a washout, a bit of a cop-out. Especially with Tyrion, with the oh, we'll just climb through the climb through the sewers, just like he did at King's Landing again. This, it, almost like a rehash of, the, of, of how he won the other battle. And and the whole Tyrion Jamie angle. He saw him at the battle. When the dragons routed the cat, the the, um, the forces, he watched Jamie. I'm not sure if you missed it or not, but he was he was on the on the um, the hillside with the Dothraki overlooking the, the uh, Lannisters getting routed, and he saw Jamie on the battlefield. Ah, right. Yes, I. That was a weird little bug there, little stutter when I'm flying my ship. Yeah, now I'm going backwards. I'm leaving the planet, it's buggy. I'll tell you what, I, I never get older watching these, these ships warp in, it looks so cool. I get what you're saying, yeah, there, there's, there's no real way he would have known that he'd survived. I wish you could communicate with the freighter pot. You know what, I'm leaving this system, it's bugged to fuck. I mean, look, there's asteroids inside the freighters. Anyway, right, let's leave. Let's jump to the next system. You are here! Orbital station coordinates received, Captain. You're about to teleport to the next system. <laughs> no, but I'm sure there was one. Uh, it's because of the weight of his armour. Yeah. Probably right. He probably should have done. But it's a show. Boom, let's go! Yeah, he should have. Uh, he shouldn't have survived that. Oh. Oh. Right. Oh my god, it's five to one. That's gone quick. It does go quick when you got people to chat. Oh shit! Not a battle. Not a battle. Not a battle. 
shit. Battle. Right then, here we go. Let's see if I can take care of this. Don't go too close to the freighter because I don't have to shoot you. One down. Four to go. Right, let's get away from the freighter, you bitch. Fucking hell. And they're too close to the freighter. Nah, dude, I got, I got this, man. I just need them to get away from the freighter, because when they're too close to the freighter... You can... Where are you? A couple of stray shots hit the freighter, dude, and you lose the chance to buy it. Two down. Three more inbound. Here we go. Get away from the freighter! They hug the freighter so you can't shoot them. Come on, come on, come on, there you go. Where are you? Come on, come away from the freighter. You don't get destroyed by the freight because you keep flying there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I think banks into the freight. Let's get out of there. You're not the one I want to shoot. Okay, how many left? You just put in on clock how many is left, because I'm too... Come on, let's get one in open space so I can shoot the fucker. Oh, you're about to die. One left. One left. Hopefully I haven't hit the freighter yet. You're dead. Boom. There we go. Now. Have I upset the commander of the... Of... Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, I did it. Definitely worth a go, Nefe. Definitely. Sorry, I was a bit preoccupied then with the, uh, the old... Uh, the old not dying in the in the dark dark vacuum of space. It's nine ninety nine. If you like, let me put it this way. If you like, shooting things, scanning things, collecting things, crafting things, mining things, building things, flying around space with a vague kind of story, holding it all together. Yes. Go for it. 9.99, well worth it. Put it this way, I don't particularly like games where you have to craft shit, uh, but this is the um, this is pretty much the only one I play. Can't stand Minecraft. Can't stand that sort of shit. Is it because of the sheer scope of it, Nephi, that you're a bit reluctant to play it? Because you shouldn't be, because it's, it's phenomenal. You can't re you can't really get lost, but can you offer me a reward?
I'm not going to be able to afford the freighter, so I might as well take the supplies. 35,000 units. Wow, is that it? The guy's flying a freighter that's probably worth 100 million. Two hundred and twenty six million for a twenty seven slot freighter. It's a tiny one. Doesn't have any tech slot. No, it does. It's got a standard hyperdrive. Oh, I got a warp cell as well. Nice. Didn't even notice that. Right, guys and girls. Uh, I'm sorry to leave you here, but. Um, I watch the wrestling on a Monday night, which is why I stay up on stream. So uh, I am going to I am going to end the stream there. Put on, put on my tele televisual stuff, and I'm going to. Move anybody who's still watching over to watch uh, the legend of Nate, who's another streamer from Team Emsley. He's quite funny. I believe he streams everything whilst riding an exercise bike. So hang around for five minutes and have a look, have a look at, at what he's doing because he's quite funny. He's playing Splatoon Two on the um, what the fuck is that on the Switch? So yeah, so I go and spend five minutes watching uh, Legend of Nate play Splatoon. Say hi. He's a good guy. Catch you later. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the bits, Gary. You're a legend. And I want to see you streaming tomorrow. Good night.